I've asked Pete Hunter to join us. I think he's our man. He's assistant chief constable of the Greater Manchester Force. Married, no children, good man, a steady man, squeaky clean. They're ready for you now, Mr. Hunter, if you'd care to come this way. Thank you. Mr. Hunter, gentlemen. Thank you for coming, Mr. Hunter. Philip Evans, Regional Inspector of Constabulary for Yorkshire. Sir John Marsden, Chief Inspector of Constabulary. Michael Warren from the Home Office. As I said on the phone, there's been another. Laura Baines, student nurse, 20 years old. Leads again. It's a farce. Now, you saw Bill Malloy on the box last night. What do you make of him? I think he's under a lot of pressure. It's become a personal vendetta. Can't have that. There'll be a press conference tomorrow. Harold Angus will tell them Bill Malloy's out. Now, there have been calls for outside help and a fresh perspective and so on. Which is why we've asked you here today. We want you to head up a covert Home Office inquiry into the Ripper investigation. Why covert? Don't want to go washing our dirty linen in public, do we? As far as West Yorkshire is concerned, your squad will be there in an advisory capacity. Mr Hunter, uh, this goes right to the top. The Home Secretary is taking a personal interest. Oh, I'm quite sure he is, sir. You'll handpick your own officers, be based in Leeds, and be answerable only to myself. Uh, and the Home Office, of course. 